So to my fellas, let me give you this little tip. God says she's supposed to be our rib. So why are we treating her like a rib tip? Throwing tips at her rack. That's a rack of ribs. Now we got a gang of kids, three or four baby mamas, racking up child support. Oh, you talking about how you got racks and how you got straps? Well, how about strapping up so we can stop racking up all these broken homes? Matter of fact, homie, how about we do it God's way? If you know you're not going to wife her, then how about leaving that girl alone? We talk about these women, but we the reason why ain't no such thing as happy homes because we more focused on being happy than being holy. We love pleasure more than being godly. That's why we lay her down and go to town on her, but won't ever make her house a home. You say it's bros over those, and we don't value her. That's why we'll throw ones before we ever make her the one. Got our kids growing up only seeing us on the weekends because we living in different homes. You tell me if I'm wrong. Yeah, I hear you. I'm with you. I know some of these women be out here doing wrong. I seen my little bro fight for years in the court system just to bring my little niece home. But that's why we got to be more mindful of who we got up in our homes. It's some things as men we just shouldn't condone. We can't blame women. They broken too. And they looking for us to lead these homes. Because our kids need homes. They want a family. That's why these little boys with our fathers join gangs, breaking their homes, and committing these armed robberies. We got to remember that we robbed them of a home. No one to grab their arm and tell them to leave that life alone. Now they got a hammer breaking in somebody's home. Because he never had a man to show him how to grab a hammer and build up a home.